Hello everyone, my name is Talia Jacknuck and I'm reporting for Kids First. And today I will be reviewing the documentary, Liana. The documentary Liana educates people about important epidemics that are occurring in Africa, but gives a creative, animated story created by the children the film revolves around. The film Liana is about five orphan kids who live in Swaziland who, under the guidance of the storyteller Jacina Malafe, create their own fictional character who embarks on a journey to save her brothers. The story the children create directly correlates with the struggles they are going through and the dreams they have. The character they make, which they name Liana, is fully animated throughout the film. This film is one that everyone needs to watch. Sometimes we can get so caught up in our lives and take a lot of things for granted. This film highlights the struggles that the orphan children in Africa face. Some of the children don't even remember anything about their parents. This film has the capability to open people's eyes to an unfamiliar place and allows people to connect on a personal level with some of the struggles the children face. This documentary is not intended to pity the children in any way, but to rather inspire others to follow in their footsteps. I find these children completely inspiring because they are prepared to do anything to make their dreams come true. They live their lives every day with happiness and passion. The animation in this film is unique in many ways. The animation is very still and the characters rarely move around in the scenes. It's a very interesting way to animate and I've never seen anything quite like this. It's intriguing to see the subtle movements of the characters and the silent noise effects in the background. The orphan children that the film revolves around are the storytellers of the animation and I love hearing the sound effects as they express the movements and actions of the characters. They will occasionally make sounds that express the weather, such as thunder, and then will make sounds representing action that the animated character Liana will perform. Overall, the sound and music in this film felt lively and upbeat. The music brought a huge cultural aspect to the film because the lyrics are in the native tongue of the people in the film. The music sounds beautiful and helps express African heritage. This film takes the audience on a whirlwind of emotion. People hear about horrific events on the news but don't seem to really find a personal connection to, to any of the struggles the people around the world are facing. This film provides a personal account on how children are dealing with disease and family issues. By providing the audience with real people dealing with many struggles, this can help spread the word that people around the world need help and that problems are not just something to flip through as you change the channel on the TV. Overall, this film is definitely one to put on your watch list. This film deals with some harsh topics, such as disease and abuse, which are important topics to express to the general public, but may be hard for younger children to watch. I recommend this film for people between the ages of 12 to 18 and above. The storyline is fascinating, and the realness of the film helps introduce people into the lives of African orphans. I give this film a 5 out of 5 stars. This film comes out on October 9th, so go check it out. My name is Talia Jacknuck. I'm reporting for Kids First, signing off.